Hello everyone, welcome back to Pabli. So in today's video, we will understand how to send automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads for fabrication industry. So here let's assume that I have a fabrication business and to promote the same, I'm using Facebook lead ads. So here my objective is that whenever I will receive a new lead through Facebook lead ads, then I wish to send an automated WhatsApp message to that lead. So now to do this, I need to build an integration between these two applications for which I will be using this amazing integration and automation software that is Pabli Connect. So here my trigger application will be Facebook and my action application will be WhatsApp. So to send the WhatsApp message, I'm using Interact over here. You can use any other application as well. So to learn more about this integration, follow me through the screen. In this video, we will understand how to send automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads for fabrication industry. So here, let's assume that I have fabrication business and to promote the same, I'm using Facebook lead ads. So here my objective is that whenever I will receive a new lead through Facebook lead ads, then I wish to send an automated WhatsApp message to that lead. Now to do this, I need to build an integration between these applications for which I will be using this amazing integration and automation software that is Pabli Connect. So here as an existing user, I'm going to sign in. But if you are a new user, you can click on the sign up for free button and you will get 100 tasks for free every month. So as an existing user, I'm going to sign in. So this here is the all applications page by Pabli. I will go to Pabli Connect and click on access now to reach my dashboard. So this here is my dashboard and to create a new workflow, I will go to my right hand side corner and click on this create workflow button. So now in this dialog box appearing, I'm going to give my workflow a name. So here I've named it as send automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads. And on my left hand side, you can see that these are the folders which I've created before. So I want to save this workflow in the folder named as Facebook lead ads. Now here I'm going to click on create. So as I did that, now I have arrived on a very important window, which consists of trigger and action. Basically trigger and action are the two most important principles or concepts of Pabli Connect on which this entire automation and integration will depend. Trigger says when this happens, action says do this. Action is an automated response of your trigger application and in a workflow, you can only have one trigger but multiple actions. So now moving to my use case, that is to send automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads for fabrication industry. So now moving to my trigger window, as I'm promoting my fabrication business with the help of Facebook lead ads. So here I'm going to use Facebook lead ads as my trigger application and here it is. And now the trigger event will be new lead instant. So the moment I will receive a lead, then automatically this workflow is going to run. So now as I've selected my trigger application and the trigger event, now moving to my action window, as I want to send an automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads. So here in this action window to send the WhatsApp message, I'm using interact and here it is. And now the action event will be to send WhatsApp template message. So as I have selected my action application and the action event. So here my objective is that whenever I will receive a new lead through Facebook lead ads, then an automated WhatsApp message should be sent to that lead. So firstly, to do this, I need to establish a connection between Facebook lead ads and Pabli connect. So here I'm going to click on connect. Now to add a new connection, I'm going to click on this connect with Facebook lead ads. I've already logged into my Facebook account in one of these tabs. So here I'm going to click on connect and the authorization is successful. So here you can see that Facebook lead ads and Pabli connect is successfully connected. Now moving to page and the lead gen form here, I need to select the page that I've created for my business and the lead gen form that is associated with my page. So this here is the page that I've created by the name of ABC Welding Solution. So here in Pabli Connect, firstly, I'm going to select the page as ABC Welding Solution. Here it is. So as I've selected my page, now I need to select the lead gen form that is associated with it. So here in Meta Business Suite, I have these three lead ads forms. So here I want to use this welding form. So this is how my form looks like. So I want to use this form that is by the name of welding form. So here in Pabli Connect, I'm going to select the lead gen form as welding form. So as I've selected my page and the lead gen form, now here I'm going to click on save and send test request. So as I did that here, you can see that it is waiting for a webhook response. 
which means now I have to do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. Now to do a test submission, I'm going to take you to Meta for Developers page. So here in this new tab, I'm going to search for Meta for Developers. I will go to the page and here in Meta for Developers, I will go to my apps and in my apps, I will go to tools. Here under developer tools, I will go to this lead ads RTO debug tool. So this here is the lead ads testing tool and this tool is going to test our integration. So you can create a test lead here to confirm that your integration is set up to receive data correctly. So here firstly, I'm going to select my page that is by the name of ABC welding solution. And now the lead gen form that is associated with it, that was welding form. So now I'm going to click on preview form. So this is how the lead ad forms looks like. And I fill in the email, full name and the phone number details. Now here I'm going to click on next. And now I'm going to click on submit. So here it says, thanks, you are all set. I'm going to close this. Here you can see it that your test lead has been sent. That means the test lead which I've just created right now would have been captured in Pabli Connect. So now I will take you to Pabli Connect. And over here in the response, you can see that I've received the details. Here is the email, full name, phone number, created date and time, along with some other details. So that means the test lead which I've just created is successfully captured over here in Pabli Connect. So the first step of this automation is set up. That means now whenever a new lead will be received through Facebook lead ads, then automatically that lead will be captured over here in Pabli Connect. So here moving further, as I want to send an automated WhatsApp message to Facebook leads, for that I'm using Interact and now I need to establish a connection between Interact and Pabli Connect. So here I'm going to click on connect. And to add a new connection, I need to mention the secret key and this here is the instruction given, so read it carefully. Now I will take you to my Interact account. And over here, I will go to my profile and in my profile, I will go to developer settings. And over here, this is the secret key. So I'm going to copy the same and here in Pabli Connect, I'm going to paste it and then click on save. So here you can see that Interact and Pabli Connect is successfully connected. So now moving to these details. So here I'm going to map the full phone number from the response that I've received. So basically mapping is to insert the data from previous steps. So here I'm mapping the phone number. So as the phone number which I've mapped follows the proper format. So that is why it is mentioned in the full phone number field. So now moving ahead, I need to mention the template code name and the language code. So again, I will take you to my interact account. So this here is the template. So here you can see that the template name is welding leads. So here in this URL, I'm going to copy the template code. So this here is the template code. I will copy it. And here in Pabli Connect, I'm going to paste the same. So now moving to the language code. So here in Interact, the language is English and the code for English is EN as per the format. Moving to body variable values. So here in Interact, you can see that this is the message which I want to send to the Facebook leads. So this here is a body variable which will keep on changing accordingly. So here after dear, I wish to mention the name of the lead that will be received. So whenever a new lead will be received, then automatically after dear, the name of that lead will be appearing and an automated WhatsApp message will be sent to that lead. So as this is the variable for name, so here in Pabli Connect and body variable values, I'm going to map the name. So here I have mapped the name. So here I have mapped the name. This method of mapping is important so that every time you receive a new response with new data, so that data can be taken into consideration in these fields. If I would have written this information manually, in that case, this information would have become static, which means that it wouldn't change even if I would have received new response. So to avoid that problem, we map the information. So now moving further, I'm going to click on save and send test request to see the response. So now here the response which I've received is a positive response. That means an automated WhatsApp message has been sent to the lead. So now I will take you to the WhatsApp message. So this here is the WhatsApp message that has been sent to the lead. So here after dear, you can see that the name of the lead is appearing. This here is the body and this here is the regards. So that means an automated WhatsApp message has been sent to the lead. So this automation and integration was a successful one. Now, whenever a new lead will be received through Facebook lead ads, then an automated WhatsApp message will be sent to that lead. Not just these applications, you can integrate a lot more applications with the help of Pabli Connect. So if you have any doubts regarding Pabli, reach us at support at And if you have any queries, you can visit us at forum.pabli.com. If you have any pricing related query, you can visit this link.
So if you like this video, please share it with your friends and colleagues and do not forget to like, share and subscribe our channel.